Nowadays, making every meeting count is more important than ever. That's where the power of ChatGPT comes into play. This tutorial is designed to show you four transformative ways to use ChatGPT to supercharge your next meeting. From summarized discussions to crafting the next agenda, ChatGPT is your secret weapon for saving time and boosting productivity. Why is this crucial for you? Because leveraging AI in your meetings means you're not just keeping up, you're setting the pace. Picture ending your meeting not just with a sense of accomplishment, but with a clear actionable plan that's ready to be implemented. That's the promise of integrating ChatGPT into your meeting strategy. As we delve into the capabilities of ChatGPT, remember that the goal is not just to enhance efficiency, but to transform the very nature of meetings into something more productive and engaging. After understanding what ChatGPT is, we're gonna dive into how it can make meeting management a breeze. You can summarize meetings in a very easy way using ChatGPT. So if we go into our file explorer here, for example, I have a transcription of what was actually talked about. So firstly, we can take our downloaded transcription and the next thing you would do would be to paste this transcript into ChatGPT and simply say, hey, can you, can you please summarize this for me? We've seen how ChatGPT here can really be effective in making a summarized meeting simply just by copying and pasting and asking it to be summarized. It doesn't take that many steps and it's overall pretty effective. I always love watching how ChatGPT works through this. Just watch as it kind of like goes on its own way. You see it talks about how we're gonna do new newsletter content, how there's gonna be video editing processing changes and some improvements to tracking as well as deadlines and video editing services. Like this is all stuff that we talked about and I'm very happy to see that it was able to take a transcript so easily and even put in the action items and next steps at the end as well as the key takeaways to get going on the next part of this. Really cool. You ever had a meeting summarized like that? I love AI. Now, another great thing that this can do is actually help you make decisions. If you take a look at this, you can actually utilize this to identify some key decisions that you'd make based off of the transcript. So as you can see right here, I'm gonna ask this so I can review the decisions, ensuring that I didn't overlook anything, right? Like content submission for newsletters, adjustment to progress tracking, exploration of video editing services. All of these things are what I talked about in the meeting, but it's difficult for you to understand the overview of what you went through because you have that huge blotch of text and you also just went through the meeting and it's a little bit hard to discern. But by having a short prompt like this showcase those key decisions, I can then realize, oh, maybe I missed something or I covered off on all of the key decisions that needed to be made. Because if I look at my agenda from prior versus what I had key decision making wise, if something was left out, I'd be able to know. And this is where this comes into play. Now, another really cool thing that this can do is that it actually can identify action items by asking it to list out the key action items and next steps for the following meeting. So with the decisions being made, the next step is always to turn them into action. Because if you don't actually figure out the action items from your meetings, you're just having a meeting to have a meeting. So you can see right here, it says specifically who, i.e. me and Sasha, are going to deliver what action items just by simply asking ChatGPT. It's always important to do that because if you don't, you're gonna be left to the wayside for sure. Then I'm gonna ask for ChatGPT to list out agenda items for the next meeting in order for us to close the loop on these different items. So, so the listed agenda items would be reviewing the content submission system for newsletters, an update on the progress tracking system, getting feedback on video editing services. These all make sense and like I said, close out the loop for the next meeting rather than us just going into agenda planning without any reference to previous meetings. I think it's great to check back on the previous one and continuously open and close loops based on conversations we had. We love transcripts and we love ChatGPT for making this happen. Now, all this is great and everything, but what I really like is our product at Tactic where all those living, these things that we just showed you how to do, you can pretty much just do with our product and don't need to deal with ChatGPT. Tactic is a Chrome extension that integrates ChatGPT's capabilities directly into a transcription service. If you go to tactic.io today, you can find that we offer a seamless way to generate summaries, identify decisions, and plan ahead. We've made a myriad of videos on it. Definitely check them out. But how do you start using Tactic today? Well, it's simple. Go to your Chrome extension store and simply in the top, search for tactic.io or just Tactic. And then there, we can simply click on it in the store. And the next step would be to install it into our Chrome. We've already got it installed on our computer, but then we can click on the Chrome extension on the top of our browser bar 
and click on that in order to sign in or sign up for our account. So let's just sign in real quick and we can go into our settings to follow up in my tactic and go to the left where we are going to join some integrations together with our tactic Chrome extension. So in integrations on the left, you're going to be able to connect your Google account or your Teams account or your WebEx, Zoom, all these options here you see. Essentially what we can do is click on connect into any of the integrations for the meetings on the top. And then from there, it'll make it so that you can have any live meetings occur and they will transcribe your conversations. So if we go into Google Meet here, you'll notice that it's gonna load into a bit of a meeting. And then on the right hand side, the Chrome extension is going. So we can go to the right here, click on that little guy. We can type notes in here in order to add context. But you see, as I talk in the meeting, it'll really quickly just take all the information that I'm saying and transcribe it. Any product would, whether it be robot, AI, there's all this fancy stuff going on around now. And I know we love the term AI, but it seriously is a great product and feature. Immediately, it has all the words I say. And from there, after I finish the call, we can go back and it'll open up the transcription immediately. We have a myriad of different meetings in our account at this point, and it's so great to go back and quickly press generate action items or write a detailed summary, leveraging the power of ChatGPT and AI large language models in order to make this very easy to go back and look for. Let's go detailed summary. You can see I already made action items in a fraction of a moment. And then finally, we have a detailed summary of how it all went with a quick prompt as well. And we could ask specific questions or search and share the transcript for anything we wanted to as well. So while you can use ChatGPT with the transcript to make your meeting life a lot easier, you also could just use Tactic, which makes that process a lot better for you by giving you transcripts to work with in the first place and to quickly augment it with the AI powered capabilities inside of Tactic. If you like this video and want to see more content on how to improve your skills using Tactic, make sure to check out videos like this one right here.